Hello guys, Keep Right on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into today's video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And if you are a Birmingham City fan that have been watching the channel in the past 28 days, we are now 22 subscribers off 2,700, and then the, the next goal is going to be 3k. So yeah, if you're a Birmingham City fan and are watching the content, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any Blues news regarding transfers and also the takeover. We're going to be uploading daily as well. We've got the Birmingham City Takeover in two days' time as well. Might be doing like a special video for that. I don't know yet. But we're going to be talking about Tahith Chong yet again in today's video. Now, it's come out. Multiple um, sources are reporting this. That um, former Manchester United starlet set for Premier League return for around £5 million. With newly promoted Luton amongst the clubs interested. Now, a lot of people will put in... Uh, put in my comment section yesterday he's not going to leave he's not going anywhere it's because he's injured that's why he's not um, in Spain with the boys for pre-season training but like I said I think there's more to this um, so Birmingham midfielder is set to leave St Andrews after two years with the club um, he is set for a Premier League return the attacking midfielder for about £5 million now £5 million you know might seem like a good fee you know it's a good deal for Blues, but I've heard that Manchester United actually would get 40% of the £5 million. So we're probably going to be making, we're probably going to be pocketing about 2.5, 2.5, 2 2.6 million pounds if we sell to Heath Chong. Like, I think this is, he's got three years left on his contract. This is absolutely, absolutely outrageous if we sell to Heath Chong. Um, yes, £5 million, pounds, but it's, it's basically half uh, because the 40% Manchester United get. Um, so we sign him for 1.5 million. Yes, we would make a profit. That would be technically, well, I wouldn't say good business, but I mean, I thought we moved away from this. The new owners are coming in in two days' time. I thought we moved away from, you know, just being a selling club. And um, who's actually going to replace Tahith Chung if we sell him as well? Which it's looking likely that he's going to be leaving the football club. Like, I don't think that Keshi Anderson, look, he looked good against Solly Moors, but I think he's more of a, a squad player, I don't think, I can't see him replacing Tahith Chong. Maybe we'll get in a lone player, like a really good attacking um, winger, a lone player. Maybe, I don't know, bring Kadra back, I don't know. What are we going to use this 2.5 million for? Are we going to be using it to replace Tahith Chong? Or, or, are we, or are we going to be using it to get the Sanderson deal over the line? Like, I'm not, I'm not happy with this. I think, you know, I know he didn't, I don't. I know he didn't exactly light the world up, light the world on fire last season. But his first full season as a professional football player, I think he deserves a second season. And I, and I do think, like I said in a previous video, the better the squad gets, the more I think the more Heath Chung will develop. I, and plus as well, him going to Luton Town. Yes, they're a Premier League club. The lure of the Premier League is a massive. You know, you can't really turn it down. But is he going to thrive in the Premier League? Is he ready? I don't even think... It says here in the article he's, he's going to return to the Premier League. I don't even... Has he actually played a game in the Premier League of Manchester United? He might have played one, but that's about it, really. Um, but, yeah, let me know what... Uh, this is what um, Eustace had to say. I've had a uh, brief conversation, said Eustace. We haven't really been able to, to sit down and nail things out. There's a lot going on at the football club at the moment. Um, I would like to think they are trusting me to get on... Uh, I, think I've, I think I've read that. Yeah, I read that bit um, yesterday, didn't I? So, Tahif Chong to Luton Town. Will it happen? Do you want it to happen? Do you think £5 million is a good price? Don't forget as well, Manchester United have 40%, get 40% off, off the two, uh, off the £5 million, sorry, so we only get about 2.5 2, million. Anyway, it's been Keep Watch on TV. Make sure to like, share, and also subscribe to the channel. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And uh, like I said, if you're a Blues fan watching the videos and have not been subscribed, make sure to smash that subscribe button. Anyway, thanks for watching as always. Keep watching.